I'm sure is the new packs that we've got coming out with the new schedule. Uh, something that we're really excited about, something that we hope you guys are excited about as well. Um, please, by the way, let us know what you think of the new packs. Uh, do you feel free to message us on Discord or through customer service uh, to let us know if there's something that you really hate or there's something that you really like and you'd like to see more of because we do think that this is a more generous offering. Um, but it's, 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 it can be hard to tell sometimes. But we are really excited about the packs we've got coming out. So we've got the card back packs and the deck sleeve packs. So these will be staying in the store throughout the whole week. Uh, one week you'll get a card back pack staying in the store from the Monday to the Sunday. The next week you'll get the deck sleeve pack staying in store from the Monday to the Sunday. It's one per user because it is cosmetic, um, but they will have a tie in with the theme of the week. So the card back pack uh, will be three limited rares or higher with and the exclusive card back for 200 gems. And the deck sleeve pack will be uh, one limited epic, one limited legendary, and the exclusive deck sleeve, and that's at 400 gems. So both of those are, are they're both gem packs this time. We've got um, the album chase pack. So the album chase pack has one guaranteed limited rare, two random limiteds, and three basics from any album. Um, we're putting those ones in at 55 gems. So the finders now, so we've got rarity based finders coming in. So basically um, when we bring out new cards for the finder packs, this allows us to bring out a common followed by a rare, followed by an epic, followed by a legendary. It just means that now we can bring out commons and uh, shake this up a little bit. It, it means that it's more fair, it's more rounded the way that we're bringing out our rarities. Um, and I'm just going to read through to you guys what's in each pack and hopefully you'll start to cross on the theme between each one. So we start off with the common finder. The common finder will have five random cards from the album uh, with a chance for one of them to be a limited and that has a 50% chance of it being the new card. The new card in these cases will obviously always be a limited common. Um, it's 20 gems so we have that 50% chance of the new card you'll get the five random cards. One chance, a chance for one of those to be limited and a 50% chance. Um, and then we move up to the rare finder. So with the rare finder, it's still the five random cards from the album, but this time it's got a guaranteed limited rare uh, with a 40% chance of also containing that new card. Um, and that's at 30 gems. So I'm um, hoping you can see what's kind of going on here. Um, as the rarities get higher, we are increasing the price point. We're bringing that chance for the new card down. But we're also introducing a guaranteed uh, limited of that rarity as well. So uh, it's it means that when you're getting a finder pack, the prices yesterday will be higher, but you're guaranteed to be getting a higher quality card from, from these packs. For example, the Epic pack, that's going to be the Epic Finder, sorry, is five random cards from the album, including the guaranteed limited Epic, um, with a 30% chance for that new card, and uh, that's at 70 gems. And finally, with the Legendary Finder, it's five random cards from an album, including, say it with me, the guaranteed limited Legendary, with a 20% chance for uh, that new card to be in it, and that's 120 gems. Um, so it's obviously quite a lot of information to take in, uh, but basically as the rarity increases, it does it means the price increases, but it means the quality of cards that you're getting will increase as well. Um, we are now going to talk about the replacement for Fusion Fridays. So Fusion Fridays, uh, the pack, we are splitting up into two packs. Um, so we are going to have the Fusion Frenzy pack and the Fusion Finder pack. So the Fusion Finder pack is going to be a coin pack usually um, currently it's gems for the Fusion Fridays pack so uh, this is going to be another opportunity if you're looking for, uh, for Fusion Ingredients cards to spend your coins so it's going to be 3,000 coins uh, with three completely random Fusion Ingredients and there could be any rarity um, and then the Fusion Frenzy pack this is going to be a gem pack for 20, for 20 gems um, and that's going to be three common fusion ingredients, two rare or higher fusion ingredients, and one epic or higher fusion ingredient. So if you compare that to the current Fusion Fridays pack, it means you get an extra two rare or higher fusion ingredients for that extra five gems. So just to reiterate, three commons, two rares or higher, and one epic or higher fusion ingredients, all six of those cards for 20 gems. Um, so we've got the grab bag. So this is going to be at 230 gems. So it's slightly cheaper than the pick and mix, but it's at 250. Listen closely as I talk through what's going to be in this pack, because there's a lot going on in this pack. So with the grab bag pack, we're going to have four limited commons, completely random, three limited rares, completely random, two limited epics, and two base epics, 
and one limited legendary and one base legendary. So that's absolutely ton that's tons of cards. You get more cards, more value there, and at the 230 um uh, 230 gem price point. That's an awesome pack and it's going to be really helpful when you're building up your collection to, to grab that grab bag every week. Uh, so we've got uh, another pack we've got is the Pump It Up pack. Uh, this is a paid pack, so this is going to just introduce another deal um, at the uh, £10, 10 USD price point. Um, just, yeah, it's just an option in the store for you guys. Uh, uh, just if you're looking to get a deal rather than uh, buying gems outright. And with the Pump It Up pack, that's going to have a limited legendary, limited epic or higher, limited rare or higher, 1200 gems, and 80,000 coins. Um, and it's very hard to describe to you in, in how much that's going to cost, uh, but roughly 10, 10, 10, 10 pounds will be the price of the Pump It Up pack. We've also got the Seeker pack. So the Seeker pack has go, is going to contain one limited legendary, one limited epic or higher, one limited rare or higher, and three random base six from uh, from an album so that they will be album specific no new cards in that one you're just gonna get all those cool cards for 220 gems um, and we are going to finish off here with the spectrum pack so the spectrum pack was basically in a way a replacement for the rainbow pack but it's very very different so the spectrum pack we're introducing at 50 gems and you just basically get one random card from each album um, we are going to look at the price point for this one definitely um, once, it's, once it's gone out but um, that's going to have seven cards one from each album it completely random could be if you're incredibly lucky that day seven limited legendaries it almost definitely will not be it could also be seven basic commons that's also incredibly unlikely it's more likely that you're gonna have a mix of the two probably uh, uh, yeah mix of uh, limited and basics as every card is basically in that pack at the same rarity it's complete you, you you spend your gems you get your cards that's the deal there um and unlike the rainbow pack as well that one's not going to be one per user so that's that's uh, you can take as many as you like of that one and that's it I think in terms of the new packs we've got coming out thank you very much for listening uh, I hope that was clear what's going on if not I'm hoping that you'll learn quite quickly with the new schedule and I hope that even if we did get rid of some of your favourite packs that we've brought something in that is really exciting for you and sort of eases that and makes you a little bit more excited uh, for the new ones so yeah uh, sad to see the pick and mix go obviously but with the grab bag I think it's hard, it's, it's hard to miss it too much. Um, but yeah, if you guys have any feedback, obviously we're always open for, uh, to hear what you guys are saying. Um, and um, as I mentioned earlier, this is not completely final. This definitely uh, will be up for change and you might see some changes. Or it might go absolutely perfectly, it's all amazing, and this is exactly how it's going to be for the rest of the time. But we have no idea yet. Uh, so thank you very much for listening and keep it cute.